What's up guys, Justin here with thesketchupessentials.com back with another SketchUp quick tip for you. So um, in this tip, I'm gonna talk a little bit about saving views with scenes. So uh, let's go ahead and jump into it. So um, a lot of the time in a SketchUp model, you're gonna be flying around a lot, uh, working on different things, and you're gonna wanna start saving your views. Like you're gonna find a camera angle that you really wanna keep, and you're gonna wanna keep going back to it. And uh, I'm just gonna show you a quick, easy way to save those views with a scene. So in order to do that, all you need to do is you need to uh, move, your, move your camera to the camera angle that you'd like. So go ahead and find whatever the view is that you want. Um, like if I wanted to keep this view right here, then you would just go up to view, animation, click add scene. So you can see what add scene does is that, that adds a tab at the top side of your page labeled scene one. So that way now you've got that scene where no matter where you're at in your, uh, in your model, if you fly around here, if you click on that scene, SketchUp will take you back to that camera angle that you wanted. So it's a quick, easy way to save a view that you like. Um, you can save multiple views at a time. So if you had another view that you wanted, let's say you wanted to be in the backyard of this model. This is a model that I downloaded off the 3D warehouse, by the way. Um, so let's say you also wanted to um, save a scene from the backyard of this model. All you have to do is you can go to view, animation, add scene, or you can just right click on this tab and click add. And you can see how that'll add a second tab. And then all you have to do is just click on these, click on these tabs in order to move back and forth between the different scenes. So you can, you can save a lot of different properties in a scene. Like for example, you can save styles or you can save what layers are on or what objects are hidden or section planes or anything like that. I'll get into a little, a little bit more detail on this in the future, but you can manage all that stuff over here in the scene section of your tray. So if you can't see that, just go to your window, default tray, make sure scenes is checked. Then you can come in here and you can rename scenes. So you could rename this like back yard and your tabs over here would update as well and one other thing to quickly update a scene so if you wanted to change your camera angle for example from over here to over here all you do is just rotate your view to your new view right click on your scene and click update and it may take a second to generate a thumbnail for that scene but now you can see if i go back to this camera angle it's at this new updated location. So it's just a real quick overview of how to save view properties with scenes. So what do you guys think about this? Are you using scenes in your models? Uh, leave a comment below. Let me know. I'd love to hear from you. I'd love to have a SketchUp conversation with you. Um, if you like this video, please remember to click that like button down below. Um, if you're new around here, make sure you click that subscribe button. I'm coming out with a ton of new SketchUp stuff every week. I'd love to have you along for the ride. If you really like what I'm doing on this channel, please consider supporting me on Patreon. Even if it's only a dollar a month, uh, every little bit helps to help me just keep bringing you great SketchUp content. In any case, I really appreciate you guys watching and I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks guys.